I am showing how to revolve in three AutoCAD 3D, how to revolve and how to create the objects in a 3D in AutoCAD. And watch my video. If you like my video, please subscribe my channel. It's related to AutoCAD and Revit. So how to do that one, I'll show you. So here is, for example, here is one, two, three circles and one profile like this. So for example, you can think like this is a, uh, one of the tires, something like that. So we made out some layer for that one. So this is the frame, uh, inner frame and everything. So I'm keeping the frame first. Frame means this one, this uh, green line. And you can set this one from the 2D to 3D. Normally we are getting 3D from drafting and annotation. So if you choose this 3D modeling, so it will come up over the 3D elements. And you, here is the view cube for that one. You can choose everything from here. And this is the navigation bar. You can rotate the things and pan the things and everything. So I'm just explaining how to revolve the things. And this is the 3D objects. So here is the home tab. So you will be get the layers and everything. Uh, from the home tab first we need to rotate this one. So this is like a 2d plane now So we need to set that one first. So go to here 3d rotate tool and select the element like this and to Click the element and just to select from this you can see three two three lines are over here So on that direction you can that will highlight which which position you need that will highlight so that that direction you can rotate it so for example i am choosing this green line and i am just pressing this f f9 uh, from here okay then uh, just uh, 90 degree i am just uh, rotating so that part will come up over like this so we need to revolve this part how we can revolve that one go to solid and there will be option like revolve select that one and select this object first this is another inner part so just select the first outer part enter then uh, cen for center select the center of the circle and you can get like the, the this direction so we need to revolve like this so just to go up over this direction and you just draw like this and enter it so that that part will be developed so we need to develop another one like an inner part so what we can do we can just switch off this layer type layer and just uh, make it this inner current layer and this one just off it so you getting this this part so just select select the outer part like this and you can go here in the downside and isolate the object so we if you are trying to do uh, trying to do revolve this one so it will not work so i will show you that one go to the solid and revolve and select this object enter it and we are picking the center point of this one and we just trying uh, trying to revolve so it will it will not work it is showing some kind of uh, revolve intersecting uh, curve like that so we need to set something so what we can do we just need to select this object go here and isolate the object and we need to set some boundary over here for boundary if you are selected for boundary just to select b type bo boundary and select the area so it was not uh, creating so what is the problem for that one you need to set some ucs type ucs then select object from here and select which part you need to um, which part you need to set up so just uh, select like this it's type ucs and you just need to select this one um, uh, otherwise you can select the objects from uh, objects objects from here type ucs again then select object select the object of this line so that ucs is set up. now you now you type the boundary because that two are in different ucs select like that and we can choose the polyline okay select this area so that was created so there will be two line so there you can get the selection like two line how will we get the selection you go here you can get the selection cycling from here just to switch oh, click over there and after that you need to turn on 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 over here then you will be get a selection cycling so just click on that one that will be on so you, once you click that one it will show how many lines or uh, objects are there 
okay then we need to develop we need to, we need to erase one line so what we can do just type e for erase and select like this and type r enter and just type uh, last object enter it enter so the last object will be going up from the here then go here and uh, end object selection so you will be get that area like whatever you have that will be come up over here then we need to develop the inner part so go here revolve command again select this part enter then sender then you can get the object snap control and press it then you will be get them all the uh, all the snaps over from here so just to select sender sender of this one and same process so just do like this so the the revolve will be come up over here just enter it so that part will be come up over here just type la and just uh, turn on our all layer just click ok so you can see here the, our uh, inner part of the tire is created so this is the way we are uh, doing for the this uh, revolve command in 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 autocad 3d so this is a simple exercise so i will show you another one example so you need to create something uh for this this area inner inner area so how we can do it that one just to copy this one copy this one oh sorry just to copy this one outside so i will show you another example how, how to revolve something other so this is the one of the profile for this one so we'll keep it over here and we just need to rotate this one okay so i'm just typing ucs world and we need to create the, the, this this one we need to rotate it so what we can do we need to rotate in x x direction so you see type ucs type x and 90 degree enter it and go here select this one and go to home select this 3d object or rotate so you can rotate it like uh, like which part you need you can rotate it otherwise simply you can rotate it this one just type symbol rotation select like this and just uh, need to rotate the things like this so it was not coming so the ucs uh, need to set so just need to set up the y direction so you can see the y direction is in the above so just type y enter enter then type a command rotate just uh, do it like this so it will come up over like that so just need to move this one in the center of the this is our profile so we need to revolve this part so move this one in the center of the circle just type cen for the center just type it like that and you just rotate it that like this so this is our base part so if you can if you need to move this one down you can move it down also just move it down i'm just moving this one down of this this area so you we can otherwise you can keep it like that only like that only so we need to develop uh, something revolve over in in this part in this uh, type of the shape otherwise you just move with this one a uh, little bit we can give uh, some heights over here like this okay anyway leave it that one no issue so we need to revolve like this shape okay so what we can do just go to the solid and we, we need to set some uh, another uh, layer uh, we can scroll like uh, I, I can just call one two something like that and I'm giving like uh, another color click OK and set this one as a current layer and go here and the solid object revolve and select this part enter and just uh, pick the center point of this one center and just uh, do the same way same way and enter it so that part will be created over here 